hey what up guys your boy I'm here right now and uh, right now we're gonna continue where we last left off we were fighting the dark pops uh, Zeke failed and so now we gotta move on we gotta fight see I don't know me and you we, we gotta fight he has about half his health left about He's should be dead in a couple of rounds, maybe three or four more rounds. Actually, I give him less, two rounds. Oh, nice. The flame shot. Flame shot. That just looks great, man. I love flame shot. It's so nice. Thanks for hitting dark, sucker. <laughs> anyway, let's go. Get hurt, man. Come on, dog, do some damage, please. Yeah, how's that for a week, father? Oh. This is awesome. Shana! Come on, get rid of those stupid pants, seriously. <clears throat> the time has come. I no longer need this flesh. What? What are you doing? Who is that? Reveal yourself. Oh, what? Could that be? Oh, no. It is! Nobu Frama! So that's what happened. 20,000 experience. Join us, Rose. One more level up for you, baby. We just want more. Come on, Rose. You gotta join me, Hashu, and Meru in the 40s club. I am the famous Melbu Frama, supreme leader of the Windies. I've been waiting for this moment for over 10,000 years. Why? You must have been defeated by Zeke. It's true that the sword of that man penetrated me. <laughs> Sounds so wrong. But what vanished is only my flesh. I cast a petrifying spell on the man. At the same time, I transmigrated my soul to the spirit. The sublime soul is immortal. How long have you been manipulating my dad? At that moment, I re-entered the light. The first light after 11,000 years. When the black monster came to meet, that foolish soul tried to release the power of the dragoon without knowing that I was waiting for that moment. So it was then I was released from the spirit and revived in order to obtain an eternal body that is proper for an immortal soul and now I'm becoming a god fuck you man oh my god what the hell is that oh shit oh crap He is merging with the Viraj embryo? I mean, is he merging? Is he going to be the god instead of Shana? You are right. I obtained the flesh of the god of destruction. I am the god himself. A god? Don't make me laugh. Huh? Lloyd! What are you doing here? You are alive. I cannot die with the wrong god still around. There is no space for you, monster. How sick is this, man? Let's go, Lloyd. All right, sorry. No, Over here. Over here. Oh, awesome. You for 
God or supernatural spirit. Pursue your own interest? Unforgivable. Destroy yourself! Ah! Alright, Alucard. Seriously, man. Oh, this is my favorite move that he does. Yes, finally, I get to see it once in this last play. Oh, I love this move. Big Bang Attack! <laughs> awesome. You bought us some Dragonfly. It's annoying. Crash! Oh, no, Lloyd! Oh, man. Forget Lloyd. Grab that Dragon Buster, man. <laughs> nah, I'm just playing. Oh, man. Oh, how dare you! What is this? It is the dragon, dragoon spirit of the divine dragon, and the dragon buster. Are you here to give us this? Don't get conceited, I just ended up here while I was pursuing my own ideal. You're right. His birth will be the death of the world. Hurry up, stop him! Lloyd. We will. Farewell. People will confront the fate of Soa. They all must perish. Why? Acquire the Divine Dragon Spirit. And guys, this is way better than the Red, uh, the red Eye Dragon Spirit. Okay. Um, my father... Uh, my father, Z, he could, he could keep it. I don't care. This Divine Dragon Spirit is immensely powerful. And we got the Dragon Buster, which, um... Uh, give me a second. First, let me talk to my dads. Dad! Let me talk to the Merus. Meru. I was gonna give you a little tour, but I ended up coming all the way here. But I was right. I was right in following Dart. I realized it. In this world, there are lots of people living with lots of thoughts. So that there are lots of fights. <laughs> there is happiness and joy as well. That is such an awesome this is such an awesome world. I won't let him destroy it. Thank you, Meryl, for understanding. I'm totally ready to go. You shall be with me in my final Oh no. I won't let him destroy an awesome world. I'm totally ready to go. What is she looking at? That's what I wanna know. Shauna, wait for me a little. Oh, that is Shauna. I was like, that's kind of an anorexic. <sighs> Excuse me, guys. Anorexic version of Shauna. Uh, we don't want to go just yet. We have been together since the moon gem was taken and Lavis passed away. We have fought, laughed, cried, and walked together all the way here. But we have to end the walk here. For the sake of the goal that led us here. And for the sake of all living creatures, now let's go. You're right, man. Let us. What do you have to say, Hashel? Dark, you look just like me when I was young. Did you notice? Alright, guys, moment of truth. I didn't understand my daughter's pain at all. That's why I dragged it around until now. Shana is the chosen girl as the soul to destroy the world. When she discovered it, nobody but Shana suffered as much. When Shana comes around, I don't know where we will be. But I know one thing, you're the only one who can ease Shana's pain. But it won't be realized unless we stop the Whitley who wants to be a god. Now let's finish it up. I'll pound my secret on into this into his fat belly. <laughs> oh, not yet. I, I thought this was the, the scene. Why are you procrastinating? I'm sorry, Ashley. Jeez. Finale of our journey. We gotta give it a beautiful ending. Bro, we're not procrastinating. We're trying to, like, prepare ourselves accordingly. When I decided to go with you, Queen Teresa told me to learn from the meaning of fate that Soa gave us. That is what I, this is what I think. Fate belongs to those who are living. It can destroy. We can destroy the fate that someone else made up. And this is a moment. Dart, let's do it. Stopping for all living creatures and their fate. Right. There is no doubt. Stop. 
Gotcha. Congo, what do you think? What do you say, my old friend? Emperor Do would often say, to make a world where all species are equal, a strong leader is needed. But Kungu knows, anyone can make a world where all species are equal. This guy is actually speaking English this time? Even you are not dragooned. Okay, I, th I thought he was. <laughs> Higatos, human, minintos, winglies, anybody. Anybody having a feeling can do. But Congo found out, anybody can destroy the world too. He got those human wingless gods. Anybody? <clears throat> Congo found out one more thing. Jackie! One more thing! <laughs> Ow! <laughs> we can stop them. Dragoons can save the world. Congo, hero of Gigantos. Congo doesn't fear God. We can stop them. Dragoons can save the world. Tell me one more thing. Congo ready. Let's talk to Rose. Sinking it behind you, Rose. What are you gonna do? Sinking it behind you. I'm gonna grab you. Rose, are you ready? Yes, anytime. Anytime. Not entirely ready yet. So let's equip some stuff. Tonight, Dragon Buster. Look at this shit, man. From 146 to 206. She will be incredibly invaluable in this fight. She's probably gonna be your strongest fighter at this point. But I'm not gonna use her. Maybe I'll upload a different version of this. Uh, this fucking. Uh, I'll upload like as a bonus a fight where you know it's it's just you know this girl fighting. Or is this girl Rose fighting against this guy? I might just do that. But let's let's uh let's get our party straight. We're gonna have Hashel. We cannot have the attack the attack badge, okay? Let's put on some Phoenix plumes. We need we need the Phoenix plumes. Magical hide, yes. Uh no, we don't need the dragon hound. Phoenix plumes for her. I'm gonna try to avoid uh, using any like broken ass fucking weapons like the armor of legend and the legend cask so I'm not gonna use those uh... dancer shoes they're required, the guard badge? well let me think about that uh... the, 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 the dancer's ring, oh no phantom shield, phantom shield might be good actually, it loses damage from all attacks by half yeah, well this lowers our defense but this is actually a very good weapon it's not broken, but it's pretty good. Uh, anyway, therapy ring for dart. I'm gonna need to do that because I want a soul leader. Uh, unfortunately, that's gonna slow us down. But you know, we need you know, sacrifice, my friend. Sacrifice. Uh, Bandit ring, attack badge. We cannot have the attack badge. Well, actually, it's not really preventing us from getting the attack badge. We can go with it. There's nothing wrong with it, actually. We can just go with the attack badge. It's not too bad. Uh, yeah, uh, I'm gonna do some more. Oh, wow, look at that. The Divine Dragon uh, Dragon Spirit. Anyway, guys, I'm gonna uh, check some more. And uh, I'm gonna try to get myself ready for this fight. Anyway, be right back. Alright, guys. So after some careful consideration, I've decided to go with this setup. Soul Leader, Magical Hat, blah, blah blah you guys can see for Dart. For Hashel, I'm going with the Rainbow Earring because it uh, nullifies any status effect. And that's going to be very useful because this motherfucker loves to throw in his little status effects and all that shit. In his final form anyway. And for Meru, I'm going to keep her as is. I think it's very important that she doesn't take a lot of damage because she's going to be our main healer. And our main supporter in every possible way. So anyway, uh, that's gonna be it. Anyway, guys, uh, make sure that you do not miss this next installment because it is the final battle. Guys, I'll see you all next time. Peace. <laughs>